All right, here with uh, Coach Jamie Dixon, and you were back here in town before the Final Four a couple of months ago, yeah. and you uh, had that nice run to the NCAA tournament. Before we talk about this uh, fun event tonight, what was good about that season you guys had getting to the NCAA tournament? Well, it was a big step for us. I mean, you want to you want to always show progress. Hard to do, and as the, as the bar gets higher, it's uh, it's hard to uh, keep raising it. But it was a good step in year two. We get in the tournaments first time. I guess they tell me in 20 years. I, I wasn't spending much time looking at the past, just looking towards the future. I uh, still felt we could have won more, done more, but um, you know everybody feels that way. But getting there is a good step, and and uh, our goals are bigger though. TCU has had so much success in football. Now mm -hmm. with what you've been building here, what do you tell fans about what you are doing to turn it into that same kind of basketball well, power? I, there was some article I think I, I think it was in Sports Illustrated that they put the rank the top uh, two uh, top ten uh, uh, football basketball programs in the country, and, and I think TCU was fifth. So out of 131 or so schools that play both at the uh, Division One level, um, you know, it's a it's a it's a good sign. So, um, you know, it's I always felt you could do both. Gary obviously has done an unbelievable job. He was uh, part of my inspiration. I mean, I, I believe that with his success, then why couldn't we be successful at basketball? So, th there was that thought into it, and, and uh, um, it's it's a good thing to do. And it's hard to be good at both. Uh, but as you can see, we're what they say the fifth in the country. So, not bad. We'll shoot for the next spot up. Since we're in San Antonio, I want to ask you about your thoughts on the city. I know you've been here a lot. What do you like when, when you come in town? I, I love San Antonio. We, you know, if you talk to people, they they say San Antonio probably won as far as Final Fours that uh, everybody would like to have. San Antonio and New Orleans. They say just bring it back, go back and forth between those two. Uh, location, proximity to the facility, can go walk, and uh, everything's downtown, and 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 uh, obviously the weather. Um, so yeah, if you if you talk to anybody uh, in the thing, the, the uh, obviously we're going to do it in Indianapolis. That's going to happen in once every four years. But uh, uh, San Antonio and is one, and, and, and New Orleans, I guess, is a is a close two as far as places to host the Final Four. What do you like about these coaches club events in particular? Is it more of a, a relaxed setting to kind of engage with fans? Well, it's different in every place, but uh, th this one is kind of nice. We, we All the coaches come down. We usually charter down and, and fly on the same flight, uh, same plane, and and uh, hang out for a couple hours uh, flying down and flying back. And then we obviously meet some people and, and uh, see some old friends too at the same time. So yeah, yesterday I saw a couple of uh, people I went to school with, you know, so uh, it's it's fun for that. When you go all around the state, when you talk to all these fans, what do they want to hear particularly from you? Uh, they want us to uh, tell, them, uh, tell them all good things. No, I mean, they, they, I think they just, you know, I think it's a way of them getting together. Sure, there's a couple speeches that go with it, and, and everybody's, you know, good in, uh, in, in May and June. It's, uh, you know, we got to get through the challenges, the, the uh, adversity, but it's, it's, it's the interaction. You know, I mean, no matter if it's a... a uh, we've had some tough years in all sports, and you know you still you still show up, you still uh, come out and strive, and, and it, I guess it's a little easier when you when you're winning and, and done the things that we've been doing here the last uh, uh, decade or so. That's TCU head basketball coach Jamie Dixon. You're watching Sports Tonight, San Antonio's only nightly 30-minute sportscast with exclusive sports coverage you won't find anywhere else.